Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Thursday, March the 12th. And COVID-19 coronavirus continues to be the top story. Uh, yesterday, the National Basketball Association suspended its season. There are rumblings that the NHL will do the same today. Yesterday, the Vancouver Canucks told all of their scouts, nationally and internationally, to come home to Vancouver. We'll leave that there. The Juno Awards are Sunday in Saskatoon, and that's 18,000, 19,000 people in the big arena there for the show. Chilliwack's Brias Gonberg is up for uh, Jazz Vocal Album of the Year and Jazz Vocalist of the Year. Uh, the Junos will, the show will go on, uh, but on their website, Karis, the Canadian Academy of Recording Arts and Sciences, has said, if you are not feeling well, don't fly to Saskatoon. If you're already in town and not feeling well, stay home or stay in your hotel room. So we're going to be following that. Uh, city or Chilliwack School District, following Abbotsford's lead for spring break, all international field trips are canceled. No one's going anywhere. A couple of new cases in Fraser Health uh, of COVID-19. So we are simply going to be keeping an eye on this. Uh, this is not going to go away anytime soon. Uh, we could comment on the comments made by President Trump. The only thing we'll say is that he has stopped travel from Europe to the U.S. for the next 30 days, but not from the U.K. and not from Canada. We'll see where that takes us. Uh, by the way, when it comes back to sports, uh, the Switzerland Premier Hockey League, now the seventh pro hockey league in the world, to suspend their season. So again, we're waiting on the NHL. This isn't going to go away. Uh, we are not, we, we do take, uh, we raise our eyebrows at those that point uh, to us at the media for sensationalizing this and for spreading fear. The bottom line is, even those of us who are grizzled veterans, and I've been in this business over 40 years, we haven't seen anything like this. We have been through SARS. We have been through H1N1. Uh, we all remember the HIV AIDS scare around 85, 86. This is as serious, if not more. It is affecting el the elderly. And uh, yeah, we're not going to spread fear. But the bottom line is, wash your hands. Do take precautions. There, that's my rant. I'm off the soapbox now. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.